time for tuning into this session so in this session what we're going to be looking into is how to use time remapping in new video editing app so I, for those that are making requests on this so here is the tutorial based on that so you can able to work to use time remapping on your clips so now as you can see i have this clip right here this is a video clip so let me play it off so you see what is going on on the clip as you can see it's just a character of an anime moving from point a to point b right there right so what we want to do now is since it's moving from point a to point b so this is a good clip to show you how to use time remapping in node video editing app or whatever software you are using that has time remapping so as you can see this clip right here first thing i would like to show you guys first is i'm going to show you how to reverse your clip first and what using the time mapping so you want to click on this this is your video right here and come to this add property right here then go to what go to time then you're going to see these two options which is your time remapping so now as you can see this is the time remapping dashboard right there you want to click on this stopwatch icon as you can see this has created a default keyframe right here from the starting point to what towards to the end of the clip right here that's why i say this clip is a nice example a clip that moving from point a to point b as you can see from point let's say this point a where it is right now and it's moving towards point b right so i want to reverse this clip to reverse it's very simple in new video editing app just click on one of these keyframe and change their what change their position because the position they hold they hold the word the length of the video so now what we did now is that we've changed the starting point from where it's top and we'll bring it to where it starts so well, this is what i mean so when i play this clip back it's gonna what it's gonna move backward can you see it's moving backward and it's not moving forward the way it was before because i've i've changed the time in remapping as you can see right now so so this is how you can what reverse your clip in new video editing app so let's go into the advanced mode let me change the position back to its normal position right here so now can you see it's not moving from its original point a to point b and not reversing again so now let me show you another example of how you can use time remapping let me say the length of the video clips is 1 ratio 13 as you can see right now so let me say i'm editing to beat so my beat my keyframe which i've marked on top of the which i've marked on top of my beat exit the point that i need to also sync my clip i can just bring my timeline towards this point right here and what and had a keyframe right here sorry and had the keyframe right here so what i'm gonna do now is i've seen the video clip of one ratio two towards this place without losing any effect. so i can delete this starting point right here and delete this and bring this one towards to the front so now i've reduced the word i've reduced the what the the clip right here towards to the part which i want it to be can you see it's, gonna, it's not going to be reaching towards the end of the clip again this is how you can just shorten so you can able to sync your montage length to what to music beats you will understand what i'm trying to say so let me reset this and show you another what you can use time remapping for as you can see right now let me say i on this point right here i want to create another keyframe right here and i create another one right here so i want what i want to reverse at this certain level right here and i want it to continue moving i want the normal movement of the clip from point a so on getting to this point which i on this road i created i want it to what i want it to what to reverse and continue the motion so to do that what you want to do let me space this out a little bit you want to create another keyframe at the center of these two keyframes you create and what all you want to do is just to drag this first one this last one right here and drag it towards and bring this one right here so this one right here what you've done right now is you've reversed this portion right here so let me replay it and you're gonna see what i'm trying to say guys it's gonna move and on getting to this point right here it's gonna work, reverse and continue can you see so you can use this to what to just speed ramp your clip if you want can you see so if you want it to be more than you can get it this closer a little bit right here so let's play it back and see can you see it's gonna at this point right here on getting to this point right here it's gonna what reverse i can see it's gonna what reverse and continue its motion so this is how you can use it to what to speed ramp on on your beat if you like so i'm going to be showing you another example of using time map let me reset this and delete this so this is the clip right here let's say i want a particular part i don't want to do it on top of the clip i want a particular part to be able to slow back so i can just find a port right here and make a cut straight away i was trim to comp area on the what on the two clip so now this is the two clip right here as you can see i make a cut right here so it's gonna what it's gonna start from here and what 
just continue with the normal motion so i want this part to what to move in normal position and get it to this second clip right here. i want it to what to reverse and continue if you want to so insist them you can just make a cut again so what you're gonna do now is what click on this one that you want to reverse and go to time remapping and quotes open your time remapping as you can see open up this and just bring this keyframe that are set on default towards this and drag this first one towards to the last part so what you've did now is that you clip on the first clip right here is gonna it's gonna move in its normal and on getting to this space is gonna reverse so let's play it all and let's see how this effect work can you see can you see it's gonna move at this spot in towards your a or b right and what's move back can you see so what i'm going to be showing you guys again is another effect so as you can see right now i have this three frame right here which has created this time remapping so i can drag this one this first one right here towards the beginning of this clip right here as you can see it's now on the beginning so when we play it back you're going to see this kind of effect can you see that smooth transition right there so you can use it to, so you can use time remapping as you wish so this is basically of using time remapping in no video editing app so if you want to see more advanced on how to use time remapping so let me know in the comment section if you want to see the advanced time remapping tutorial so hope you guys gain value out of this session if you did give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you in the next topic peace